here, as you guys know, and and you guys, we don't get to talk that often. Right. So I was just wondering if you ever wanted to catch up, not in, in front of the audience, in a more private and personal way. Yeah. yeah I mean, I, I, I would, actually. That'd be a nice experience. Great. Well, join me now. In the Late Show's personal space. Yeah. Conan. Conan, this is the Late Show's personal space, which we have made uh, taller for the first time just for you. And if I could get an Apple box, that would be great. If somebody could just put me on the same footing as Mr. O'Brien here. Yeah. Thank you very much. I'd rather put tall, that man. right there. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, citizen. <laughs> All right, you ready to do this, Conan? Yeah, I... All right. Okay, so I just I put my head you in put here. Put your head in the box. And you ask me questions. I will see you in the box. Thanks for joining me in here. This is nice. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Um, you've been a host for 25 years. It's, and yeah. uh, in my opinion, you've done an amazing job. And um, I admire you. I look up to you. Um, something of a mentor. And Why something of a mentor? <laughs> what's because what's... You, you've never actually mentored me in any way. I just, in my mind, you're a mentor because yeah. I like people to think that we know each other. Um, what have you learned over 25 years that I haven't learned in 14 years? Like, what's the next 11 years? What am I going to learn? And what, like, what, what do I need to know about having the longevity that you have? You're going to learn never humiliate a guest. Are you aware, I don't know if you're seeing what I'm seeing. I, this is absolutely true, but I'm so close to you right now you, that you have one eye. Same thing. Do Same I have thing. one eye? You have one, one big blue eye. Yeah. In the middle of your face. Yeah, and, and it is, uh, I feel like this is a dream I've had where you're staring at me with one eye mm -hmm. and we're trapped in an alternate cardboard dimension. Yeah. What'd you have for lunch? Garlic chicken. <laughs> Broccoli with, uh, I believe, garlic. It checks out. And then checks they, out. Uh, they, make, they make a garlic soda now. You can have it. Um, you're famous for your hair, and I've, I've long admired it. I don't have the loft anymore that you, that you have. And I was wondering if you would give me the honor of allowing me to brush your hair. I'd be thrilled if you would brush my hair. I don't know how this is good. How do I look now? I can't see that high. Comedians often cry on the inside. Do you want to cry on the outside? Do you want to just let, you know, just let it get a good cry out? Can I you? can't. I don't cry. You can't cry? I give so much to the audience. Have you ever tried? Have you ever tried to cry? I've tried to cry. Okay. Want to try? I've you tried. Try with me? Okay. Ready? What do I do? I don't know. Think of a sad thing, maybe okay. from your childhood. I don't need to go that far back. <laughs> you ready? Ready? I think we got something right. Ready? One, two, three, sad.
Did you get any real tears? I got a little bit. What were you thinking about? The fact that I can't cry. Yeah. You know what I was thinking about? What? I took a red out of New York to do this show and you put my head in a box. Now, I've, I've heard that you're 100% Irish, and I'm 98.5% I'm Irish. I had my DNA done, just like you. Would you like to join me in a chorus of Danny Boy? Because the acoustics in this box are amazing. Right? I would. <clears throat> <clears throat> Can I uh, make it the right pitch? Mm -hmm. I'm up here. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> That's high. Yeah, I like to go to high tenor. Uh, Listen to this. Hold on, let me try. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, Danny boy, the pipes, the pipes are calling from to Glen. You don't know the words. To I don't know the you words. You don't know the words to Danny boy. I don't. I, I don't. I don't know those words. You're not. Because I'm always... not Irish. No, that's probably proof that I am Irish. No real Irish person knows that song. Tura lura lura, tura lura la. God, you're loud. You asked me to sing in a box. I didn't know and then, how loud you were. And then criticize the volume. I'm not criticizing. <laughs> I'm describing. I'm describing. I say it with respect. You got some lungs. Yeah, I do. Sometimes comes in handy in show business. <laughs> I'm a fan of yours? I don't, clearly not. I promise you I'm a fan. A longtime fan of yours. Really? Yeah. yeah. First time caller? Yeah. And I was wondering if I could get your, if I could get your... The oxygen, there's very little oxygen there's... left in here. We you know really? what? This is a this is a box filled with carbon <laughs> dioxide, right. this and is, this is I, uh, I I haven't been able to think straight for about thirty seconds. This is a, I just saw my grandfather, and he passed in 1976. Could someone call 911? Could I could I get your autograph? Of course, it would be an honor to give I it have, to you. I have a I have a pen right here. No, no. No? Just use your mouth. Got it? And just <laughs> use your mouth and sign my face. Use your mouth. Use your mouth and sign my face. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Conan. Weeknights on TBS. Conan O'Brien, everybody. Thank you, Conan. I'm honored. I'm very honored.